Imagine waking up one day and not recognizing your loved ones. Scary, right? Keep watching to discover a shocking truth hidden by the billion dollar health industry. You're here because you've started to notice that you're forgetting the simplest things. Maybe you find yourself having those blank moments, not knowing where you left your keys or why you walked into a room. And you've been worrying, thinking this might be the start of something serious. Something that could rob you of your memories, keeping you worried about ending up in a nursing home, or forgotten by your loved ones. Maybe you've already seen the doctors hoping for relief, but they couldn't do much except hand over a bunch of vitamins or pills and tell you, it's just part of aging. But as you'll see in a moment, you'll be shocked to discover that the doctors and billion dollar health industry have lied to you. Telling you there's no solution to the memory lapses that are slowly taking over your life. All because they never revealed that a toxic mineral found in everyday food we eat and the water we drink is responsible for slowly killing your brain neurons and erasing your memory. They keep selling you expensive brain boosting supplements, memory therapy sessions, and drugs with severe side effects. Without ever revealing the inexpensive and natural memory revival tonic that you can use right now to reclaim your mind and feel completely normal again. In a moment I'll share with you the studies from Harvard and Stanford revealing that these senior moments are a symptom of a much more serious underlying condition that most doctors fail to recognize. And if you ignore these signs, Harvard scientists are saying you could be on your way to developing chronic brain damage, severe cognitive decline, or even full-blown cognitive decline. Erasing your entire memory, making you unable to remember your loved ones, or even yourself. I'll show you the studies from Stanford showing that your memory problems aren't caused by your genetics, aging, or anything else. But in fact, a toxic mineral infesting your brain and killing your neurons is the culprit behind all the memory issues you're experiencing. But as scary as that sounds, know that there's hope. Because a former army neurosurgeon broke his silence and revealed a three-second memory revival tonic that neutralizes this toxic mineral from your brain and allows you to keep your memory strong well into your 80s and 90s. This three-second memory revival tonic has been once only reserved for military officials and special ops to fight memory loss. But starting today, you can get access to it and use it to clear the fog from your mind, once and for all. This natural solution is so powerful that it has already been clinically proven to work for anyone, regardless of their age or the severity of their memory issues. So, even if you've lost hope in the medical system, and even if you've tried everything without success, it's important you stay with me until the end of this report. Because in just a few moments, you'll discover how to stop feeling like you're losing your mind and take back control over your life. As soon as you start using this memory revival tonic, you'll feel like you've stepped back in time. You'll start remembering names, dates, and important tasks as effortlessly as you did in your 20s. You'll wake up with a razor-sharp mind, effortlessly recalling your thoughts and conversations from the day before. No more confusion clouding your days, no more anxiety over forgotten details, and no more pretending during conversations. And the best part? You'll no longer fear losing your mind or ending up in a nursing home, forgotten by your loved ones. Simply put, once you start using this natural and inexpensive memory revival tonic, memory loss won't be a part of your life anymore. You'll put a stop to any brain damage that might have already started to develop, all while protecting your memories, sanity, and health for years to come. Just like the other men and women who have already used it and said goodbye to their memory challenges. Now. Before we continue, there's something I need to tell you. I've been receiving threats from the big pharmaceutical companies because they don't want the public to know about this natural memory revitalizing tonic. So, I don't know how much longer I can keep this website up and running. I urge you to remove any distractions around you and pay close attention until the very end of this report. Because what I'm about to share with you can literally change your life or your loved one's lives forever. Hi, I'm James Anderson. For the past 30 years, I've served as a professor at one of the most prestigious universities in the country. However, I'm not here today to overwhelm you with scientific jargon. Instead, I want to share with you one heartbreaking event that led me to discover the natural memory revival tonic that restored my wife's sharp mind and vibrant life. Linda, my wife, used to be the one who remembered every little detail. She always knew what groceries we needed, the dates of family birthdays and anniversaries, and even when bills were due. But as we were approaching our mid-sixties, 
everything began to change for Linda. Out of nowhere, her memory started slipping. It was like watching her fade away right before my eyes. At first, it was little stuff, like forgetting why she walked into a room or where she put her keys. We joked about it at first, blaming it on brain farts or too much on her mind. But then Linda's memory slips became frequent. She'd repeat herself twice or forget a story she had just told five minutes ago. Sometimes she'd spend the entire morning looking for her glasses, only to find them in the fridge or in the trash can. Man, it got rough. Bills were forgotten, we'd end up with doubles of everything from the store. As the days went by, I started to get worried. But Linda kept insisting she was fine, denying anything was wrong. Until one Sunday, our lives suddenly turned into a nightmare I'll never forget. That morning, our daughter stopped by and dropped my grandson before she headed out of town for work. I was at the local farmer's market picking up ingredients for dinner when my phone rang. It was our neighbor, her voice shaking as she said, James, there's smoke coming from your house. It looks serious. My heart dropped. I called Linda multiple times, but she wasn't picking up the phone. Worried sick, I raced home as fast as I could. When I finally got to our street, I saw smoke pouring out of our house. The door was unlocked. I covered my mouth and charged inside, following the sound of my grandson's cries. The smoke was thick, and I could barely see. I found him on the ground, his little face red and coughing, struggling for air. I scooped him up and ran outside just in time as the firefighters arrived. We rushed him to the hospital, where they treated him for smoke inhalation. Meanwhile, We found Linda sitting on a bench at the local park, completely unaware of the smoke filling our home and the chaos it was causing. 